Is everyone ready to go? So today we're going to focus on, Alex asked me to focus on some team passing, a little bit of shooting, and uh, some team play, so team flow drills. So you girls enjoyed the last one, right? We did like tons of shooting, uh, which was great. So we'll do that, and we'll do some drills that complement those skills. Um, but our main focus is like passing. Let's get ready for playoffs, right? Have you guys done any playoffs games yet? No. Not yet? Okay. Until February. All right, well, it's coming up. Let's get ready for it. All right, everyone get behind me. Quick, 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 quick. Fast, 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 fast. Goalie's at the back. Okay, hey, watch the first drill. Watch. As soon as you skate forwards to the red line, pivot to backwards at the red line. At the blue line, pivot to forwards. At this red line, pivot, and then finish right here. Ready? Go. What's your name again? Sorry? Maddie. Go, Maddie. Uh, one more time. Finia. Finia. Go. Julia. Julia. Angelica. Sinead. Sinead. One more time. Sorry, Brittany. Go, Brittany. What's your name again? Lily. Go, Lily. Go, Brittany. Go, Lily. Go, Lauren. Go, go Lauren. Mateo. Hey, Matea. Abby. Matea, right? Yeah. Yes, Matea. Abby. Okay, ladies. Our main focus is just not to go through the drills, sort of through the motions. To get from blue line to red line takes five strides. A double B player might take only like three or four. So aim to take those five strides and then crossovers backwards, forwards, pivot here, cross, 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 cross. It's all about the number of crossovers that you take. Ready? This is later going to turn into a two on O. So the first girl in line, Amis, would do exactly what we just did later. But now the second player in line is going to do this. So we're actually all going to do this right now. But the second player skates forwards to the red, pivots to backwards, crosses with the right leg, crosses with the left leg, and then crosses forwards, and then finishes there. So you're staying on this side of the ice. Go, Amis. Maddie, Finia, Matea, I got it now. Matea, Abby, go Taylor, go Kate, go Callie, go Lily. A lot of us, Taylor, we're focusing on only doing like one crossover. To hit the red, it doesn't take one crossover. It takes like three or four. And then three or four the other way to place you in this, on this side of the ice. It's all about the number of crossovers. Watch me, go. So nice. Four or five strides, crossovers on the right leg, crossovers on the left leg, and then even crossovers forwards. So eat my knees, just finish over there. So it's just this, and then up, okay? Go Maddie. Callie. Callie. Leah. Leah, got it. Brooke and Emma. Brooke and Emma, can you guys get inside the nets after you do this last one? Hey, one hard lap this way, one hard lap. Hurry, hurry. Okay, bring it in, right here Callie. Right here, right here, right here, right here. Okay. Everyone take it in, just relax in this general area. Amis, can you help me just so you did last time? So do you remember the first drill? You skate to the red line, pivot to backwards. Uh, at the blue line, pivot back to forwards. At the red line, pivot, and then you'll finish up against the boards. So we're gonna go nice and slow. Amis does exactly what we did last time, the skating pattern for the first player. We're gonna go very slow. I'm gonna do what we did the second time. The second person has puck control. Let's go slow, go. So I've got puck control, pivot to backwards. Good, I pass it to you. Do not pass it until you hit the red line. Pass it to me. Okay, now stop. So this is where we don't wanna make the pass, ladies. I wanna give it back to Amis, but she needs to pivot and get close to the boards. So now you go ahead, pivot. Good, that's it. So now she is on the left side of the ice. I am in the middle lane of the ice. So now she can see me. And in the left corner of her eye, she can see where she wants to go. So we would do this obviously very fast. I pass it to her. Two on O, oh. go. This way, two on O. Oh. Yep, drop pass. Go back to the net, ready, shoot it. Rip it, rip it. Nice. When we're done, we finish over here. Ready? Don't forget, you have to hit the red line before making the pass. You got the puck. Yeah, exactly. Callie and Leah. Yes. Woo! Go! Fast, 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 fast. Make the pass. Pivot. Crossovers. Okay, ladies, look at their feet. A lot of their feet. Get up against the boards. Uh, Callie, yep. Yeah. Okay, that's good, but a lot of them are, a lot of the skates are kind of just doing this. So Anise, we want to focus on this. If I want the pass over there, don't kind of lean towards it, skate into it, receive the pass. It's all about the number of crossovers. Ladies, finish over there, next two, go. Fast, 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 fast. Lauren and Lily, passes ladies. Nice hard passes, this is good. Go. Fast, 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 yep, next two. Here, here. 
Awesome. Go. Nice pass. Next two. Go. I mean, so you and I want to go. You can go number two this time if you'd like. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Rip it. I like it. Same thing against Emma now. Next two. Go. Fast, 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 fast. Start again, ladies. Start again. Start again. Start again. So, hey, hey, Brittany or uh, Angelica, Callie kind of did this with her feet. We want the pass over here. Focus on crossovers. It's all about the crossovers. This is exactly why we didn't just jump into this drill, because I want you to focus on the crossovers first. Go. And make sure you switch positions. If you are one, then go two. Here, here, go. Against Emma, against Emma, go. Go. Hit the red line, Finia. Hit the red line first, Lily. Go. Hit the red line up here. Yeah, on your, by yourself, by yourself. Let's do it again, go. Switch positions now, Leah. Uh, and Callie, the other girl goes number one. Go, go. Speed up, ladies, speed up, speed up, go. It's all about the crossovers. Cross your feet, cross your feet, go. Go. One hard lap, one hard lap, nice, hurry. One hard lap. Bring it in, bring it in, bring it in. Right here. Uh, Maddie, can you please stand on the red line right there? Finia, can you stand on the blue line right in the middle of the ice? And Mattia, can you stand on the red line over there on the other side of the blue line? Uh, on the other side of the circle. Everyone take a knee right here. Just chill. Emma Brooke will shoot on you girls in again in a second. Okay, uh, sorry Mattia, on the red line over there, I'm gonna make a pass uh, to Maddie. I'm gonna then take her spot. Maddie, you're gonna make a one-touch snap pass. Pass it back to me. Show me a one-touch snap pass. That's it, exactly. Just sweep it and follow through and it'll be a harder pass. Ladies, who can skate this fast? No one can skate that fast, but we can move the puck that fast and that's a really important skill. If you girls, especially going into the playoffs, are the fastest skating team and the best, fastest puck moving team, you won't be beat. Okay, those are the two main things that we're focusing on today. So I'm gonna pass it to Maddie. Maddie's gonna make a nice quick pass to Finia. I take your spot, you take her spot and do it as fast as you can. Finia, you then pass it to Mattia, you take her spot. Mattia, how fast can you skate to the net? Shoot on Emma, and then come back into our line. Ready? Every pass is one touch snap. Um, one thing, do not receive the pass, then look to determine if she's a lefty or a righty. Hockey's too fast, you gotta make, you gotta, before you get the pass, just do this in the corner, yeah, yeah she's a lefty, boom, and then it's off your stick. Ready? Go, fast, 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 go, go, nice. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Awesome. Uh, Leah, can you take my spot, please? Is that right? Yes? Woo! Leah, you get up there. Give me half over here. Give me half over there. Let's go. Hurry! Lots of girls on this side. Yeah, right there, Mattia. Uh, Taylor, do you want to take one of these spots? Kate, you want to take one of these spots? Good, thanks. Angelica. Uh, Lauren, can you come to this side too, please, just to even out the lines? All right. Hey! You girls do your own thing, you girls do your own thing, but the next girl in line should not go until it reaches the third girl. Once everyone has made the pass and it's crisp, then we go. If, let's say I make a bad pass, then Callie can, from the corner, give me a pass from here just to keep the drill moving fast. Help each other out, support each other. Go! Nice, nice. Nice. Great stop. Lauren, can you give another pass to Brittany? And then Brittany, you pass it to me. Angelica, can you pass it to me? Hey, watch. This is really important. This stick is $300 and it's completely useless if I have no weight in it. Even if I grip it really hard. And a lot of us, pass it to me here, Angelica. A lot of us are doing this where we have no weight 
and we're just kind of brushing it. That's just called a whack. It's just called a whack. It's got no weight. So hey, get in this stance, arms away from the body, flex your stick. The sweep should be long, loud and quick, just like our shots, and point to your target. If I want to hit Angelica's blade, I don't point like this. I point like this. Just go deeper, and it's going to be a good pass every time. No! Stop. Hey, let's not get to this last spot, and then the girl just skates to the net like this. Charge to the net, and then rip your shot. Just pretend as if you're, someone's chasing you from behind. Go! Hey! Yeah. Nice shot, Kate. One hot lap, get a drink. One hot lap. Hey! Right. Bring it in. Right here, right here. So nice skates. I was thinking about switching over to the vapor one. It looked good. Um, ladies, awesome. When we do one hard lap, remember, I have to stop you every single time, otherwise I'm not gonna earn my big paycheck. So when you girls are doing your one hard lap, we can't go at, it looked like, I don't know, 75% as fast as we could skate. I don't think, if there were any girls that were skating at 101%, then good, good for you. But we need literally every single person buying into the idea that we have to practice like the way we play. A lot of, especially girls teams, they've got like perfect practice, makes perfect games and like awesome slogans like that. And it's 100% true. I never really listened to that and thought about it too much as a kid, but now I'm like, oh yeah, that's very important. <laughs> so when you skate one hard lap from the red line to the net, imagine as if, just like we did last time, that's the first period uh, Olympic gold medal women's game. Your team Canada, Coach Randy puts you on the ice and she's expecting big things out of you. So is the entire country. Show me how fast you would skate in a moment in the first period of that game. Second period of the game, red line to the blue line, desperation, still second period. Very important game, Cheer, the whole country's cheering you on. We don't slow down to 75%. We still skate at 101%. Blue line around the net, back to right here. Your last 101% stride, that's where it's gotta finish. This is a hard thing to do, because one hard lap, it's like, especially, you know, I come on out and it's a little bit of a different style of practice than maybe when Alex and Randy are running the practices. And it seems like a lot of the time, we can like sort of chit chat and whatever. So I've been your age before. When we're out on the ice, let's absolutely socialize and have some fun. But the main thing is when we're skating one hard lap, when we're doing each of the drills, let's just not do it at 85% or whatever. Let's literally do it as fast as we possibly can to the best of our ability. And what's gonna end up happening in turn is you're gonna become a better individual player, you're gonna become a better individual player, and then collectively we're just gonna be this unstoppable team going into the playoffs. Does that sound good? Let's forget about second place. Let's get up to first place and then just annihilate the competition in the playoffs. Go, 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 go. One hard lap, go. Run Stefan over. Ladies, I know you can skate faster, go. Go! Whoops, sorry, Emma. Awesome. Grab a drink. Awesome. Grab a drink. Awesome. And behind me, two lines. Uh, yeah, right up against the boards. One line behind Finia, one line behind me. Fast, 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 girls. Quick drink. We'll get another one in a second. Um, Anise, you're going to go all the way around the circle. Tons of crossovers. Forward stride, take about five strides. Forward, Forward stride, yep. And then a, a million half crossovers, so really, really, really quick ones. Don't stop crossing your feet. I'm gonna give you a pass at the blue line. Don't stop crossing your feet. Charge to the net and then no, score on broke. We're just gonna go around the circle once. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Watch Anise, go. She's the first girl in line. I'm the second player. I make a pass up to her. The objective, I should have passed it a bit further ahead than that. The objective is to make her speed up. Okay, so don't pass it to where she is. Pass it to where she's going to be. And then you girls, Finia, are gonna come around the circle and then Maddie will make the pass to you. You only pass to you, you only pass to you. Ready, ready? You got the uh, no puck, Angelica, you're gonna skate. Julia, you will be the one to make the pass. Yeah, same time, on the whistle. Go! Come on, skate, skate! Take a look right now, Angelica, take a look. Yeah, a little bit further ahead, go! 
Get that pass far ahead. Leah, make it hard, really hard. Go. That's great, girls. Hard pass. Nice. A little further ahead. Go. Take a knee, relax, take a knee. Um, I know it starts with an M, I just keep mispronouncing it. Mateo. Sorry, Matea, you get ready to give me a pass. Watch this pass. Oh yeah, I like it. So that one, I do not have to slow down. In fact, I had to speed up. That's what we want. Doesn't get better than that. The harder, the harder, the better, okay? If she can't receive a hard pass, that's okay. We're just gonna make her a better pass receiver the next time. Go! Heads up, heads up. Go! Got that ahead. Sorry, Maddie. Hey, sometimes as Leah comes around, if she's ahead of the play, maybe to make the pass to Maddie, I might need to move or I might even need to saucer it up and over a stick. So let's look, just interpret the other player where they are and passing it around them. Go! Fast, Finia, put it in the net. Nice shot. Finia, try bottom left. Go! Yeah, you're gonna go the other way now, so you'll shoot on Brooke. Go. Ready, Angelica, you'll shoot on Emma. Ladies, switch sides, Sinead. Ready, go! Speed up, speed up. A little further ahead. Go. Yeah, you got it, you got it. Yes. Go. Can you give me a pass here, Callie? Watch. Is this as fast as I can skate? It's definitely fast, but nowhere near as fast as I can skate. You make that pass to that girl, set up. I say go. Take five strides, take a hundred crossovers, and get that pass ahead. Ready? Go! Go! Nice pass. Go! One hard lap, one hard lap. Randy, can you help me just put some pucks right here, please? I'll get the other side. Take it right above the blue line. Maddie, would you mind going to the bottom of the circle, please? And Finia, can you go to the top of the circle, please? Okay, we're gonna split into four different groups. Each group will have maybe four or three players. Uh, each uh, group will go into each corner. I'm gonna start inside this corner. There's a community pile of pucks right here. So both Angelica's line will go this way, I will go this way. We're making eight passes. So just listen to my voice. Finia, go right to the top of the circle. Go ahead, Emma, yeah, thanks. Um, every pass, one touch, snap pass. Don't sweep um, where it's kind of short. It has to be long and you have to point directly to your target. If at any point one of us misses a pass, we're gonna maybe collect one from the next person in line or someone will go to get it as fast as they can and we'll just keep the drill going. My job is I'm gonna skate all the way around the girls inside out and then I'm gonna go in for a shot on Emma and in between all of that, we're taking eight passes. Just listen to my voice. I pass to Maddie, she passes to me. I pass it to Maddie, she passes to Finia. Finia passes it to me. I pass to Finia, she passes to Maddie. Maddie passes it to me, and then shot. So what we're focusing on is with every one of those passes, I don't wanna have to slow down. They are stationary, so their job is pretty simple. They just gotta point to the target and sweep. My job is just to be able to keep my feet moving as fast as I can. If we can't get eight passes because someone mishandles one, get four or five in. Just, I don't wanna have to slow down. Uh, so obviously I went incredibly slow. I want you to go as fast as you possibly can. And then, <laughs> sorry, after I shoot, it is important to remember, I'll take Maddie's spot. Maddie will take Finia's spot. Finia will be the next girl in line if there's not already one. And then you girls just take off on your own. Don't even wait for the whistle. Yes? Let's do it. All four corners. Set it up. Set it up. Eight passes in total. Ready? Thanks a lot, Randy. Um, so, Leah, do you mind going inside this corner and you can go with these girls? And you girls, yep, um, Abby. And you four. Hey! So, why don't you start at Nice and Abby will go second round. Okay, that's good. And ladies, 
Brittany, Mattia, you girls will be right in the middle of the ice right here. So start right here. You girls, Kate, will go to the left. You girls, Brittany, will go to the right. Hey, watch again. One to Lily, to me. To Lily, to Lauren, to me. To Lauren, to Lily, to me. Shot. And then I take Lily's spot. She takes Lauren's spot. Ready? You got it, Britt. Go! Keep going, keep going, and shot. And now Emma. And switch, you got down there. Bring it in, bring it in. Hurry! Okay. Everyone understands the drill? Love this drill. Um, two main things that we need to correct and just improve. So first, we're doing the drill. Everyone understands the drill. Now we're not focused on the drill. Let's focus on the skills. Skills are this. Skaters, you are just crossing over as fast as you possibly can. Uh, just imagine uh, an NHLer or a CWHL girl just flying through this drill as fast as they possibly can. And then with each one of the passes, they just need to be getting f off of my stick onto the next girl's stick faster. So sweep it long, loud and quick, and point to the target. It's going to be a good pass. Um, and then the second thing that I noticed was as the last player is coming around, we make the last pass and it's coming back to you. What I always do is this, just picture that. So I've just skated around the circle. The last pass has gone down to the girl at the bottom of the circle. Watch my eyes. Instead of me receiving the pass and just looking at her, receiving it, and then looking at my target and then shooting, it takes too long. We want it to be a one-timer. So as soon as it goes down there, my eyes just do something like this and like that. And I'll just kind of look in the corner of my eye to determine what is Brooke giving me. If she's giving me that bottom left corner, I receive the pass, look, and it's a quick little shot. Okay, so just use your peripheral vision. Let's go, let's go. And hey, switch sides. Switch sides now. Left, go to the right. Ready? Go. Oh. Speed up, Kate. Speed up, Kate. Come on, Kate, fast, fast, fast. Shot. Nice. Nice, nice job, Brittany. Stagger them. So go ahead, Sinead, when you're ready. And ready, Callie, go. And now go. Just try to stagger them, Lil. Let's go. Chuck, you're doing great. Great job. Okay, why don't you bring your water bottles over here and just take a knee with them. Take a knee with them. Does anyone have any ideas on things that we can improve on? You tell me. Uh, does anyone have anything, any ideas on skills that we can improve on? So Everyone get as close as you can to Anise over here on this side. Wait for this drill? For any of the drills that we've done so far. Yeah, Emma. Faster? I like that. So to get from blue to red takes five strides. A uh, double A girl would take five strides. A single A girl might take four. A double B girl might take only three. So taking the appropriate amount of strides. You, who skated, who's been at the double A level before? Okay, great. Who has skated maybe tryouts or whatever? Maybe you have some friends that are playing for the double A Dolphins or something like that. Okay, so when I was playing like, when I was like 11, playing double A, and I went to a few games with my dad to go to the triple A the next year up, the two things that I noticed were one, being a year older means you gotta be a hell of a lot faster. Um, and then the second thing, because they, were, they had body contact. So that's why we went and we went to go check them out. And we wanted to see like, okay, what does it look like to be body checking? And the speed was so much faster. They were hopping the boards, which is something that we just didn't do when we were 11, but apparently you do when you're 12. And they were taking just the appropriate amount of strides. So each of you can skate at the AA level. It's all about the appropriate amount of strides. Um, some of our stances were a little bit high. Let's just get a little bit lower on those front legs, uh, quicker feet, things like that. Okay, everyone come over here so you can see. Um, I like this drill. This one's called Martin's Cross. The first girl will not have a puck. The second girl will have a puck. Same thing on this side. The X's are gonna go, the next whistle, the O's are gonna go. Both of you girls go at the same time, but I'll just show it out of this corner. X1 is gonna skate to the opposite side of the circle. You're gonna stop. Number two is gonna give you a pass. You are gonna one touch, pass it back, and then you're gonna skate in the opposite direction. Number two from your line will give you a pass, and that should be a head girl pass, head man pass. Receive it without her having to uh, not break stride. 
We want her to break, uh, not break stride. And then she's even gonna shoot it without breaking stride. And then as simple as it gets, you're just gonna always go back to the exact same corner that you started in, okay? Um, number two, your job might look like this. You're gonna skate, number one is gonna stop at the same time you girls are just gonna crisscross. Just stop on the edge of the circle. Number two, before you make this pass, you will pass it to her, pass it back, and then you'll chip it out to her. If you get a really crappy pass back, get ready for a second puck and then dish it out to her. And then again, this girl will pass, give it back. You're just gonna skate through the middle, receive the pass from your line and then shoots. The O's have done nothing. So don't look for a pass as you're skating through to this line. Look only to the line that you came from. The next whistle, the O's will go and repeat the same drill. Um, number ones, it takes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight strides. That's probably pretty appropriate. And then it takes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, actually about the same, seven or eight strides to get to the net. Especially because we're going from a stop position to a start position, focus on taking those really quick, like you're revving up your engines. Rev up your engines as fast as you can. Um, if you take seven strides, you're a single A player. If you take six strides, you're a double B player. Let's just take the appropriate amount of strides. And upon the stop, four things are gonna happen at once. You're gonna stop, receive the pass, give it back, and do a crossover start all at the same time. Okay, it has to be that fast. And then just charge through the middle. Don't go 101% and then 80%. Go 101%, 101%, shoot, and then just chill out. And then you get to make, be the passers. All right, let's go all four corners. Fast, 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 fast. Let's see some nice goals too, ladies. Ready? So more over here. Uh, Liat, would you mind over here, please? Thanks. Okay, Anis, let's go very slow. No puck. Angelica's got the puck. Finia, you're going to skate without a puck. Let's go very slow the first time. Abby, you'll make the pass. Watch! Watch! Go. And stop. Give it back. Oh, right to the edge of the circle. Sorry. Go right to the edge of the circle. And try again. Pass. Give it back. Pass. Give it back. Yep. Good. And now Finia, you get a pass from Abby. Angelica, you make the pass over to Anise. And shot. Pass, give it back. Good, skate through the middle, get a pass from your line. That's it, easy. Go. That's it, ready Tails? Ready, Brittany? Anise, can you give me a pass? Hey! Hey! Yep! 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 <laughs> okay, hey! Let's focus on that type of speed. Accelerate as fast as you can. Let's get up to 101%. Ready? Here we go. Hey! The passers, pass it before she stops. So pass it when I'm like right here, and then by the time it reaches me, I can cross out, receive it, and then go. Ready? Go! Go! Okay, hey! Awesome! Our main focus is number twos, give nice, solid, perfect passes. All you gotta do is be in a good, strong stance and make a good pass. If you get a bad one back, quickly grab your other one and then right back to it. Focus on technique, not from here. Crosby would look like this, so let's look the same. All number ones are gonna go at the same time now. Instead of going across the ice, you're gonna go in a circle. Okay, so Taylor and Leah are going to shoot on Emma. Uh, Brooke, I mean. Mattia and Anise are going to shoot on Emma. As long as you know you girls are shooting there and you girls are shooting there, then the drill's easy. I'll show it out of this corner. I'm going to skate to the second girl. Uh, Maddie will give me a pass. I'll give it right back. Easy. I'll go to Finia. Receive a pass, give it back. I then go to Lauren, pass, give it back. Thanks, Taylor, that's okay. This is the line that I started in. So Callie, Ephinia, 
Finia, this is the pass that we do not give back. Finia, watch. I receive this pass, and all I know is you girls need to score on this net, so I'm just gonna skate hard all the way down and shoot on Emma. Instead of going back to my line, I'll just go to whatever line has fewer players. So first person in line, stand up, no puck, get ready to skate very slow. Second person in line, you're gonna be the passer. Number twos, you are gonna pass to Anise, get it back, then here comes Taylor, pass, give it back, then here comes Leah, pass, give it back, and then finally, here comes Mattia, pass, and then she goes in. And then you become number one. Let's go slow. You girls shoot on Brooke, you girls shoot on Emma. Go slow, go. Pass, give it back. Next, pass, give it back. Next. Last one, last one. And go shoot. Take that one, Leah. Take that one, give it to her. And go shoot, Leah. All right, that's it, shoot. Okay. Great, and Leah, you go to this side now. Don't go back to your line. Stay on your side of the ice. Just go to whatever line has fewer. Ready? Go. Pass, give it back. Not yet, Finian, one more. That's okay. Can we speed it up? Can we speed it up? So now, hey. Skate, pass, give it back, crossovers, pass, give it back, pass, give it back, get your last pass, and then you're off. Go! Skate, skate, skate! And shot. Nice, Taylor. Okay, bring it in, bring it in. Around the semicircle, right here. That's great. Hey, Brittany, can you stand right there where that puck is? Come over on this side here, please, Abby. Um, so two things, one, everyone understands the drill now, yes? So I think years ago, I took this drill off like a Pittsburgh Penguins practice on YouTube. So just imagine how they would be skating. Imagine Evgeny Malkin just flying. Imagine Crosby just flying through this. So Brittany, give me the best one touch snap pass right back to my stick. Good girl. Do that same thing. Slide your hand down just a tiny bit more. Flex your stick as hard as you can like you're trying to break it. And the sweep shouldn't sound like this, but like this. Quick, loud, really powerful. Now, beautiful. Isn't that so much of a better pass than the first one? First one was good. First one was a double B pass though. I want double A. Second one was double A. So now let's get up to that level with every single one of our passes. And I want you flying, absolutely flying around the circle. The only thing that we're gonna change is the direction. So you two girls are now gonna shoot on Emma and you two girls, those lines will shoot on Brooke. Anything else? Um, some girls are electing to do this instead of actually calling out for it. So uh, let's be more, if we have the best communication, it'll be so much easier for us to be playmakers. In a few minutes, we're gonna start doing some flow drills. Everything's easier if we can talk. Anything else? Hard passes! Good job, Britt. Last one, last one. Yeah. The last, the last pass, the last pass is kind of a head man pass. Get it? Pass it ahead to where she's going to be. Go. Hey, which one's better? Watch. That one or this one. I got lucky. So hey, I just want you skating faster. Don't take these strides, take those strides. Go! Right in your feet. All right. Let's go Taylor. I need to back up just a bit, Finia back up. Um, 
Taylor, you skate to the net as fast as you possibly can. Show us, with your puck, sorry. Uh, show us any shot you want. Back leg or front leg, or if she's challenging you like she is, she, you can deke. Uh, even defensemen like Eric Carlson, I've got some sick moves, so you're D, right? Um, show us, if you do shoot, show us the best shot you've ever taken in your life. Every single shot has four components. Does anyone remember what they are? Accuracy is one. Before we have anything, we need what? Even before, well, mentality actually should be probably the first thing. You know what, you're right. Mentality should be, we shoot to score. score. Every single one of the shots that you've ever taken for the rest of your life now, even if it's in mini sticks, you shoot to score. It's just taking an extra little bit of attention. I have to tell my son sometimes, he plays basketball, and sometimes he just goes and just fires it at the net, as opposed to just taking an extra half a second and just putting it in, and it's like almost every single time he puts it in. Go ahead, Taylor, go. Fast, 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 fast. Head up. Oh, I like it, I like it, nice. Everyone kind of thought she was gonna shoot, right? Especially because she kind of came in with a crossover this way and a crossover that way. It's a good way to make a goalie move. I like it a lot. Um, her head was kind of up a little bit from here into the edge of the circle. But as soon as she got to that ringette line, her head was up and she knew exactly what she was going to do. Um, Anise, let's see it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go. Fast, fast, fast. Nice. Awesome. Nice try. So, hey. I know you kind of lost the handle there just for a second, but way to get it back. That's just like a second effort thing, which just happens in hockey all the time. You lose it, you get it right back. Keep focusing on keeping it, uh, getting it right back. Uh, that was basically it. Maddie, you want to go? <laughs> go. Fast, 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 fast. Put it in. Nice. So, hey. With each, with each one of our shots, so you're right, Sinead. The first thing is mentally, we want to shoot to score. Second thing is technique. We need a proper technique. Sort of go hand in hand. You can't just have a powerful shot because it'll hit it right in the chest or you'll miss the net. So we want to shoot to score, right? So we want to be nice and accurate. Um, we still need to focus a little bit on technique. A lot of the girls that were just shooting, you're kind of like shooting and placing your body weight like away from the net as opposed to we're like placing as much weight as we can into it. So maybe I got some power, but I got to focus on accuracy. Um, are you guys ready for some team stuff now? Let's do one hard lap, let's get a drink. Let's go, let's go. Grab a drink. Let's do, sorry. Let's do a pucks right here and there, please. Yeah, thanks. I like this one. Okay, we're all the defense. Well, the D, nice. So defense, here's like the referee circle. You will all kind of line up here, but we're gonna start with one girl in the uh, blue, uh, two girls on the blue line here, and two girls on the blue line here. You are D1s, and you are D2s. Forwards will be on all four corners of the blues, facing into their corners. All right, and this is forward line ones, and these are forward line twos. This is a two on two, okay? Um, the first forward, I just want you girls to dump the puck inside the zone. So pucks are going to be here and here. So you're going to dump the puck inside the zone. D1 is going to go to pick it up. I don't want you to go D to D behind the net unless it really makes sense to. But you will kind of come to here. You might even go to the front of the net to guard the front of the net. Forward number one and number one here, you girls are focusing on uh, doing like a, a pivot. So if here's the circle and here's the dot, you go through the middle first, then pivot to backwards, then pivot back to forwards. Always go in this direction so that we're always looking at the puck. You're always looking in this direction, looking in this direction, and then pivoting. And this girl does the same thing. So you go for, through the middle, pivot towards the boards, and then come out with some speed. Uh, we want to receive the pass from the defenseman before that ring at line, which is right here. So she's going to basically... This defenseman, beeline it, go pick up the puck. I want you to come to a full stop, turn, and then just give this pass, or take three or four strides, if it makes more sense. And as she comes out of the pivot, she's gonna almost come to the middle of the ice, and you can give her a nice breakout pass. Um, forward line with number ones, you girls are gonna head in this direction towards these two Ds. While that was happening, these two Ds, you maybe stepped up to this far blue line, and then you pivoted in this direction, and you pivoted in that direction, and you're gonna start backing up all the way out to the blue line. 
And then as soon as you get to the blue line, whoever of these forwards has the puck, don't make too many pa don't make any passes to each other. Just make the breakout pass and then get through the neutral zone. Make a pass to her. This time we're going to do what's called a neutral zone regroup. So you go maybe lower than the blue line. Defense, you girls will be backing up almost to that ringette line, which is about here. You, I want you to, if it only, if it makes sense, and if you have time, go once, D to D. So a quick D to D, so just once to her, not giving it back unless it really makes sense. And then as this happens, as they cross, it might make sense for you to make a pass to her, or it might make sense to make that long distance pass. While that was all happening, these two D that were down here, you girls are gonna step up to about the red line, pivot to backwards in your own direction, and then we're heading back in this direction two on two. So to remember this drill, um, so key things to remember, if this side, if we dump it inside this corner first, then we're gonna end up shooting on that net. So it's simple. We dump it into this corner, you break out, you neutral zone regroup, we shoot on that exact same side that we originally started on. Next whistle, after the two on two happens, these two D are now out of the play because they're going in two on two. So they need to be replaced by the next two D. She goes there, she goes there. These two girls stay in. Next whistle, F2, you've got the puck. You're gonna dump the puck in. You girls do your pivots. Defense go to pick it up. We break it out. We do a neutral zone regroup with the next two new defensemen. And then we go two on two back against you. Later, if we have some time, we'll go ahead and into a three on two. But let's just start nice and slow two on two. If this drill doesn't make sense as an illustration, watch. Sometimes that was like me, but I would just kind of watch two or three rounds. I'm like, okay, yeah, I'm good to go now. So let's start slow and then we'll speed it up. Forwards, get on all four corners of the blues. Defense over there. Fast, 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 fast. Okay. My side. Okay, watch. Let's go slow. So give me two defensemen. Uh, Finia, who's your partner? And yeah, Britt, go out there. So watch, let's go slow. Angelica, you and I. So you dump it in. We'll go very slow. Ready? Dump it in. Brittany, you go to get it. Good. Inside out, go towards your boards. Yep, to me. Yep. Good. Back up, back up. Crisscross, crisscross. Go to Angelica. Good, two on two. Drop pass, drop pass, here. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Shoot. Oh, nice. Okay, hey, awesome. So now you girls stay there. Give me two new defense here. Defense, you finish over there. That's it. And now we go this way. Ready, Kate? Go. Yep, quick breakout, yes. To the defense. Yeah, that works. To the D. That works. High girl, high girl. Keep going, keep going. And hey, Abby. And Taylor shot. Okay, hey, I shot Taylor. You girls don't jump into the play because I want you to go right to the next one, but nice shot. Over here, nice D to D, Abby. Actually, you girls go to this side. We'll go against you, Taylor and Abby. Maddie and Anise or Callie, go. You get that next time, Abby. That's it. That's right. Keep going, keep going. That's it. Hurry, Brittany. Quick breakout. Good. Neutral zone regroup. Good. Lauren, Leah, stay there. And hey, Anise. Dump it in. Next two out there. Yep, yeah, great. Bring it in. Bring it in. Awesome. Hurry. Okay. The same girls that were getting ready to go, get ready to go again now. Uh, everyone understands the drill? Okay, so now all we're going to change is the sides that have the puck two girls are gonna be on that side. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna keep the reds together, keep the greens together, and the blues together, perfect. So we're gonna have just the reds on this side, so two girls on that side, one girl on this side. 
and we'll have the blues you girls can start out of this corner and then we'll have the greens on that side too. So actually you girls will start blues and then we'll go reds and then the next time we'll go green and it'll just work out perfectly. Defense, you girls keep doing what you're doing. I know you girls want to jump up into the play after you've made that last neutral zone regroup to enter into the five on, it'll be now five on two, but don't. I want to quickly change direction and go back in the opposite direction. Um, so if you hear a whistle while you're going in three on two, that's just for these girls to start. It's not for you girls to, to finish. Um, keep going until either the puck is in the net or it's smothered, okay? Um, unless it just goes on forever. Does everyone understand? I think we're good to go then. Um, let's use the high man every single time. One girl takes the puck in with enormous amount of speed. We give it to the high girl. The other girl either drives to the net or gets open for a nice pass. Uh, when Angelica and I went, she made a nice little one-timer. Uh, one so let's focus on that. That's elite level stuff, and let's do that stuff. That looks good. Um, let's go. Uh, you girls, and we'll go towards you, Taylor. Okay, so hey, one thing, ladies. Who's the centerman? Uh, Julia? If Julia's center, then maybe while the wingers pivot towards their boards, she can just go stay in the middle of the ice and maybe look something like this. If it comes up this side, she goes here, starts nice and slow, receives the pass maybe or not, but just get through the neutral zone with few passes and a ton of speed. Get it the hell away from our zone, get it into their zone as fast as we can. Let's try to go fast. Go! Yep, up, right away, up! Yeah, to your center, to your center. Pass it up. Crisscross, everybody. Crisscross. That's fine. Good. Let's go this way, Finney and Britt. Go. Eddie. Reds. Go. Fast, fast, fast. Take it yourself. Yep, take it yourself. Good, Brittany and Finia. Huh? Back up just a little bit more as you're receiving the pass. Come here. And then D to D. All, it's almost like you're in motion. You're receiving it, making the pass, and be below the blue line. Ready, blue. Yep. And uh, Finia, this way. Go. Straight up, Britt. That works. Go to your winger. Chip it up. Back up. Back up. Back up. And pass. Chip it up. Someone should be here. Hi, man. Help, help, Julia, help. Hi, man. Yep. Nice, cycle it, cycle it. Here, here, here. Keep going. Green, go. Nice. Shoot. Ladies, let's talk. Talk really loud. Tell each other where you need them to be. Get the rebounds, shoot to score, go. Nice, Emma. Yeah. Keep going, go. Green, hey, hey Brittany. Uh, Finia. Mm -hmm. And go. Hurry, Brittany, hurry, Brittany. The puck movement's fantastic. You are clearly a very good team. Um, excellent skating, communication can be up a little bit, but as soon as we're entering into the zone, that's about the only minus that I gotta say. The defensemen, keeping in mind it's a three on two, the defensemen are pinching really quickly, and you gotta go to the high man very fast. And then we're not, sometimes we're getting a good shot off. Angelica got a good one on this side. A few girls got a good one on this side as well too. Um, but then, you can't get around Brooke and Emma. It's like the defensemen are relying on the fact that Brooke and Emma are such good goalies, and all they gotta do is just kinda prevent you from getting to the net to get the rebound. Yeah, go ahead, take that shot. So what we need is we need what? What do you think? We need to, yep. Like, we need people to get to the net. Mm -hmm. We gotta just create traffic. We gotta get like some of those really ugly goals. Really ugly goals. Um, 
we just, I grew up in Brampton and and playing Brampton hockey, and we just call it, used to call them just ugly Brampton goals. <laughs> so it's not like someone's skating in at full speed and ripping a nice toe drag and then a shot top right corner or something like that. It's like someone's taking a shot and everyone is doing what's called collapsing to the net. You collapse to the net. Uh, if Angelica's shooting, you've got Callie and you've got Anise just charging to the net for tips, screens, and rebounds, okay? Or you're charging to the net and maybe last second Angelica makes a nice little slip between underneath someone's stick and then you're ready for it and then Anise takes a quick little back leg shot, boom, it's in the net. And that will get Brooke moving from here to have to move all the way over to here and as long as it's a one-timer, we won't be able, she won't be able to stop it in time. So these are the things that we need to work on and we'll work on next time. Um, you guys want to finish with the game? Yeah. Yes? Okay, um, help me first. Actually, help me second. We're going to do one hard lap. We're going to grab all the pucks and we'll put them inside the referee circle. Yes? Go, 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 go. One hard lap first. All right. Does everyone know table hockey? Does everyone know those games? Sometimes they're at arcades or at rinks and they're the bubble. There's a bubble. Sorry. Uh, there's a bubble over the rink and you got like those little joystick kind of things. So that's just like this. That's why it's called table hockey and it's three on three. Here's the referee circle. We'll have X's on this side, O's on this side, and I'll split you up. I'll be right here. Um, let's have the first three players will come into line. X1 will be here. If you start on this side of the ice, you're going to be shooting on that exact same side. X2 will be here. X3 will be here. X1, sorry, the circle should be something like that. X1, you are restricted. You can only stay inside this area. X2, you are restricted and can only stay inside this area. X3, this is your area. Okay, you girls can pass it around as much as you want. You can come right to the front of the net, X2 and X3. So if X1 shoots it, you can come right to the front and screen, tips, uh, all that stuff that we were talking about, rebounds. Uh, you just can't pass through the middle point of that. O1, O2, and O3, they have the same restrictions. Um, one whistle, or if I say new puck, then I'm gonna say new puck and I'll just dish it out to one of you. If I give three whistles, then get out and the next group will jump in. And again, because you're restricted, let's say if I pass it to her, this player can, if you look at the circle, you can come almost right up to here. And if you girls want to make any passes to each other, you can intersect those. So your feet can't leave the circle, but your stick definitely can. Um, intercept saucer passes, bank them out of the air. Anyone tries to pass in between, use, you can come right to, even X2 can come right to the edge of the circle here and act like they're on defense as much as you can. O1, it may seem like a small spot, but if you move from here to here, like you've got a lot of space there to be able to stay away from her, 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 that might be poke checking you all at once. One touch passes and one timers. Those are your best friends for this drill, okay? Are you set? Also all ready to go? Everyone meet me on the other side, fast, fast, fast. Hey. Brittany and Finia, can you girl, girls go on this side? You girls come on this side of the edge of the circle. Hey, how do you know who's on your team? Brittany and Finia are wearing black jerseys, but you girls are wearing black jerseys with blue socks. They've got white socks, and I think you girls are deep partners, right? Okay, so red versus black versus white socks, green and blue. Give me the first three blues. Um, Lily, you straight here, sure. Uh, Mattia right there, or whatever. Julia, you're on the far side. Hey, you girls are shooting on Brooke. Julia, sorry, you're right there. Yeah, and Angelica, you're in the middle of the ice. Callie's over there. Anise is right here. All right. You girls can take an E if you want. Just relax. You girls can take an E if you girls want. Just relax. Okay. Ready? Play defense as much as you possibly can. Go. Here, here. New puck. New puck. Go. Get open. Get open. New puck, new puck, new puck. New puck, new puck. New puck. New puck. New puck. Nice. Ah, oh, nice. Awesome shift. Let's have quicker one-touch passes. Don't get it, then get rid of it. Get it, get rid of it. And if you are here, then quickly get here. You have to get here. Get there faster. Take the appropriate amount of strides. 
Instead of going from here to here at this speed, just go faster. Get out, next group jump in. That was great, really good. Perfect, go! Nice, nice, shot! Ah, oh out, new group, or sorry, new puck. Hey, girls, hey, Sinead got it, stopped it, then passed it to Kate. Kate stopped it, then passed it to Maddie. Everything was a two-touch pass. You pass it to me, it was one, receive it, two, look, three, pass. I want you to look, yep, get it, and it's off, okay? The, the way that you're gonna move Brooke and confuse the other players is with fast puck movement. Everybody should be in this stance. Sinead, go. Yep, oh, nice try. Yeah, 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 Taylor, nice. New puck, Sinead. Not every time should it be a one touch. Maybe it makes sense for Leah Lily to get it and then see what she's got and then maybe just take a shot, right? Just take your time. Sinead, you got it? Go. Nice fake. Good, out, out. Next group. Hey, switch up positions. Switch up your positions. Go. New puck. Nice. Nice. Give it back to her. Oh, shoot it. <laughs> I thought it was enough to go to Angelica, but you confused Emma even more. New puck. Callie. Callie. <laughs> Four minutes left. You can cheat. You can cheat as much as you want. So, hey, that means you can stay on your side of the ice, or Mattia can go straight over to Abby if she wants. Play, incredibly good defense and incredibly good offense. Last shift, you only had to focus on offense, then defense. Now you gotta focus on both almost at the same time. Ready? Go! Just regular three on three, basically. Yeah, you're right. Steal it! Yeah, you can go anywhere you want, Shane. New puck! New puck! Nice. New puck, new puck. Sorry, Julia. Go ahead, you got it. Out, out, good, switch. Three, two, quicker shifts. One, go. Come on, three on three. New puck, new puck, new puck. Defense, new puck. Ladies, you guys did great. That was fantastic. Um, so going into the playoffs, let's start competing at that 101% level and you girls are gonna be more than fine. Um, everyone did great. So next time that I come on out, I think it's a good idea to work on those similar types of skills and then just breaking down. Sometimes instead of just taking a shot for the sake of shooting, you shoot to score. Uh, other than that, you girls did great. High five to Randy, high five to Stefan, high five to me. Great job, great job, great job. Okay, uh, that was fun. Uh, so that was the Dolphins, Double B, uh, I think minor Pee Wee or Pee Wee team. Um, tons of fun. They might have been Bantam even actually, because they're a lot, uh, a lot taller um, and a lot more mature. So they're fantastic, really good group of girls. Um, what I like the most is that they're really hardworking um, and they listen to absolutely everything. This is normally with girls as well too. It seems like they just really pay attention to you. So. Um, it's just so much easier when you've got that type of uh, mentality going into it. And it was also nice as well too that they're all just like very friendly, very affable girls. Um, in terms of the drills, um, the main practice, the main focus was all on passing, team flow. And so a lot of the girls did a really good job of just like, it seemed like the passes were at like a double B level. And I kept sort of saying that with their skating and both their passing, where some of their passes are really hard uh, and then some are not. Some are consistently accurate, some are not. So to get up to that 
double A level, the highest level for girls. We want to make sure every single pass is consistently hard, consistently accurate, and uh, as well as their skating. There's just a lot of the times, especially when we go, went into the Rebels two on one, uh, two on two drill, um, and as well as even table hockey. I maybe should have pushed them a little bit more uh, just beyond their comfort zone because a lot of them were less competitive than I want them to be, less aggressive, uh, entering into the zone in the two on twos really slowly and you know doing a great breakout, doing a great neutral zone regroup and then actually entering into the zone. Uh, they weren't actually stepping in with some with some grit and with some speed and like how an NHL player uh, and NHL team would do. Uh, so that would be sort of my next thing that I would work on with them. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, thanks very much for watching and we'll see you next time.